it's one o'clock. Time for a core live. Can you guys see me? Is, are people on? Hello. Let me move this over a little bit. Okay, we're going live. Um, today, it's only about a 30 minute um, workout. Good, hi Maddie. And we're gonna start with a little warm up and then we'll go straight into our abs. We're gonna do some circuits with the abs and then the glutes and then the abs and then the glutes. And then, hi Amanda, hi Jelaine, hi Linda, hi Sammy. And um, then I always do a little finisher, a finale um, at the ends, our favorite part. So, hi Patty. So we'll go for about 30 minutes. It might be about 25, 30. So let's start uh, by standing. I'm gonna turn on some music today for us. Hope you're all doing good. Okay, so let's shake it out. And we're just gonna start with a step and lift our legs to the back. Now if you wanna add some arms, you can pull, reach and pull. Now we're gonna change this so that your knees are coming up in the front. Pull it down, pull it down. Good. And four, and three, and two, and one. Now we're gonna go back to the, the leg lift in the back. Good. We're just getting the blood going so that we're not working right into the, um, exercises without our blood pumping. Now let's go overhead with our arms and our knees. Good, and we're gonna go now into some body weight squats. Here we go. And take it down and up. And you don't need to go fast. There's no reason to go fast here. I want your own tempo. That's one thing we're gonna do today. These are gonna be um, time-based exercises. So, um, you will be doing at your own tempo. It might be slower than my tempo, it might be faster than my tempo, but it's time-based, so they'll probably be about 30 seconds long. Some might be 20 seconds long, but I'll let you know, but I'm on top of it. Now let's go down and hold, hold, two, three, squeeze it up. So this you can do with me, two, three, Squeeze it up, and down, two, three, up, down. Now this whole time, I'm still working on my core. I'm pulling my abs in, and up, down. Two, three, let's do two more. One, two, now squeeze those glutes when you come to the top. Two, three, let's take this foot, take it to the front, bring it back. Other foot, body weight lunges, bring it back to the side. Side, and up, and side. Let's do that again, just body weight squats. But we're actually gonna be on the mat most of the time today. Sometimes my, I hope some of my regulars are out there. You know that we do standing glutes. But today, we're all on the mat the whole time. Good. Let's take one leg and we're just gonna cross it over for a glute stretch and then we're gonna come back up. So it's active. Down and up and down and up. Other side, we're almost warm. We're gonna hit our abs first. Okay, I'm feeling good. Maybe swing your arms back and forth. We looking good? Okay, I'm gonna take off my glasses because here we go. Okay, I'm gonna pause this music for a second. I'm gonna show you the round for the abs. We're gonna lay down and our hands are behind our head. We're gonna go into regular crunches. 30 seconds. Then we're gonna take one elbow across to the knee for 30 seconds. Then we'll do the other one. And then we'll go into elbow center. Switch center. We'll do that. And then we're going to go into elbow hold. You should really feel your obliques working. And then four tiny little pulses. 
three, four. Then to the other side, and four tiny pulses. Of course, I'll talk you through this, but I just want to show you a few of them. Next one, your arms are down. You're going to do tiny marches. So these knees never come above your hips. They try to stay in line. You can have your head up, or your head can be down, but your back needs to be flat down on the floor. From here, we're going to go into the Pilates. Um, straight legs, two pulses here, pulse, pulse. Then we'll come up to our elbow plank, hold, and then we're going to come up to a high plank, and we're going to go slow, slow mountain climbers, and then four quick mountain climbers. And then after that, we'll do our glutes, and I'll talk you through that. But I think your abs might be on fire at that time. But let's start. Everyone come down on the mat with me. Hands behind the head. Feet are flat. Oh, elbows are open. And let me get my timer going for us. And we're going to do 30 seconds of each. So pay attention to my voice as we go. Here we go. And take it up. 30 seconds on. Now you want to make sure you're initiating with your core, not with your neck, not with your hands or your elbows. Everything starts in the core. And lift. And again, your tempo. This is all for you. So if you need to be faster, if you need to be slower, that's your choice. We're going to in five seconds, taking the elbow to a knee. Here we go. Four, three, two, your choice. Just remember what elbow you're using. So again, initiate with that oblique right there. Try to get that shoulder blade up off of the floor. Reach across with that elbow and feel your feet flat on the floor. Don't let your knees um, splay open. Keep them parallel and lifted. And we're going to go to the other side in three, and two, and one. Other side. Here we go. Take it up. Find that other oblique. You're doing great. Whenever you need a break, take that break. Belly button to the spine this whole time. You've got to keep that lower back down on the floor. You might have some abdominal muscles talking to you right now. They're just beginning. Now we're going to go center side, center side in three, and two, and one. Here we go. Let's go to the center. One to the side. One center, and one side. Very good. Oh my goodness. Uh, my abs are starting to say something to me. One center. One side, one center. Let's see if we can get two more in. And then we're going to do that up to the side. Hold with the pulse. Here we go. Pick a side, hold it there, squeeze, and do four little pulses. Four, three, two, one. Let's go to the other side. And up and hold it. Four little pulses. One, two, three. Four, and again, up, hold. Four little pulses. Four, three, two, one more this side. Take it up. Four little pulses. Pulse, pulse, oh my goodness. Legs up to tabletop. March those legs out. Trying to not take a break, but if you need one, it's there for you. So I'm just touching my toes down. You can choose to touch your heels as well. It's a little bit harder with the heels. But again, don't let those knees come all the way up because then you're using your hip flexors. Yes. Four. We're going to make these straight legs. Three, two, one. Here we go. Straight legs, double pump. Now, if your legs don't go straight, that's okay. You can keep them bent. And if you need to grab your thighs, that's fine too. How are we doing? You can also relax your neck if you need. Okay, here we go. We're doing great. We have 10 more seconds here, and then we're going to flip over to our elbows for our 30-second elbow plank. Four, three, two, one. Good. Roll it over. Oh, my goodness. Get into that elbow plank. Let's do it right away. Squeeze your glutes, try to keep your feet together, ankle bones together. Now, if you want to add the saw, you may, which is you just rock forward and back. But keep those, that abs strong. 
line and then we would go four, three, two, one. All the way to the end of this ab section. Oh my goodness. See if you can get one more set in really good. And one, one, four, three, two, one. Lower it all the way down. Oh my goodness. Hands on your shoulders. Let's stretch that out. Oh, my abs are on fire. Anyone else? Wow. But yes, we can do it again. I promise. I've done this one several times in class before. Right, ladies? We can do it? All right. We're going to concentrate on one glute. Find your favorite glute. We're going to spend about five minutes on this one side. And then we'll go back to those abs. And then we'll come back and go to the other side. Are you ready to join me? Woo! So we're in. One. I just want to let you know, we're going to be in this most of the time. And I don't ever want this to happen with your back. You've got to keep that belly button in strong. Okay? So we're going to start. I might face this way to start with. Flex your foot. And we're going to bring it up. And then we're going to come down and touch the floor. That'll be for 30 seconds. This one, you're just going to follow along with me. I'm not going to show you the exercises. Here we go. Up and down. Because I think you've probably all done these before. Now, when you do this, keep the belly button in and try to get that knee above your hip line. Not just down here. Try to get all the way up. Yeah. Good. Try to get it all the way up. Now we're going to come up and we're just going to pulse it up. In three, two, hold it up and pulse. Now see if you can get that knee over your hip. You're doing great. We're here for 30. It may not be too bad yet. Maybe not. We've got 15 more seconds here. The next one, we're going to extend that leg and it's going to come up and down. So it's going to be a straight leg in three, two, one. One. So we're going to stretch the leg down and we're going to bring it down and up. Down, up, down, up. Okay, so you might get a little bit right now. And you also need to do a check of your abs to make sure that they're still working. You don't want to be a loose in your abdominal wall. Yes? We're doing great. Very good. Next one. We're going to do in and out. So we're going to hold it up. Hold it up and out. Out and in. Yes. Yes, we are. Out and in. Very good. Keep it here. We have two more things to do up here. I kind of went out of order, but it doesn't really matter what order because it all fatigues our glutes. We're going to take a bent knee position here, and we're going to go cross it over, take it up, drop it down, take it up, and again, cross it over, take it up, bend it down. This is your own tempo. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Very good. Hope you're doing good. I wish you were in class. I wish I could see all of you. Now we're going to extend the leg out. Stretch it out. Let's do some pulses. Pulse, pulse. Hello. Take a break whenever you need, but try to work through it. Four and three. Now we're going to do a rainbow. This will be our last thing up here. We're going to take this leg, cross it over, and open. Cross it over and open. Cross it over and open. Cross it over. Very good. And over and open. Let's do two more. You can do it. You can do it. And one. Last one. Two. And great. So come down to your side. We're going to lay on the side so that the leg we're working is up on the top. We're going to extend the leg, and we're going up and down. Now, my toe is pointed towards the floor. So join me when you can. Very good. 
Point that leg down. This other leg is bent to a 45 degree from your hip. And you have a smile on your face. And you love me forever. I know you do. <laughs> we're gonna take this move and we're gonna start going in and out. In, push it out. In, push it out. Good. In, keep that toe facing down towards the floor. Now this whole area should be lighting up. Yes. Not red, because that means stuck. We're lighting it up green. We're going. We're going to do this. Now we're going to do a knee to toe touch. Ready? That sounds fancy, but it's just this. Yes. And one, two, one, two. Very good. Mm-hmm. Very good. Now we're gonna uh, take our leg out and hold it out and just pulse. Now we're gonna bring it to the front. Front and back. Front and back. And front and back and front. Now take it front, we're gonna hold it. This is our last one. Lift eight, seven, six, five, Four, ah, three, two, one. Oh, yes, roll on your back. Let's take that leg you just worked and cross it over. Oh, I don't even know if I can get into the stretch. It hurts. <laughs> Here we go, let's stretch it out. Woo, yep. Very good, very good, very good. So, what's on tap for the rest of the class? All of that again. Abs, whoo, and then the other leg. And then the finale, one minute finale. So that's my favorite part. All right, hands back, let's go into these abs. Let's take them up. Now you've been here before, so you know what's what we're doing. See, now right now my abs, they were hurting, but now they feel better. They want in a little bit, but I'm happy to, that they have recovered. 10 seconds, we're gonna pick an elbow and take it to the knee. And four, and three, and two. Let's take an elbow to the knee, here we go. We're here for 30 seconds, and then we're gonna do the other side. So we're on the same side. Keep your knees pointing straight up to the ceiling. Tempo is your choice. This music's a little bit brisk. It's more important to have good technique for your abdominal work than speed. Let's do the other side. Here we go. Now, think about pulling that shoulder up off of the floor too. Try not to just use your elbow. I'm thinking about my my obliques pulling me up, and then my shoulder is going towards the corner. The next one is where we go center, corner, center, corner. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. Here we go. And center, and take it across. Center, take it to the other side. And center, take it across. Very good. Our next one will be the cross with the pulse. Very good. We have four seconds. My, my timer's on my watch. That's why I keep looking at my watch, if you're wondering. And four, and three, two, and one. Pick one side up and hold it. Two, three, now pulse it. Four, three, let's go to the other side, and up. And pulse, pulse. One more each side, here we go, take it up. Two, three, and pulse. And other side, and up. We're going to tabletop next, marching those legs if your neck needs a break. And march, march. 
This knee stops right in front, in, in line with that hip. Now, if you want to use your heels, do that. Extend the legs a little bit longer if you need a little bit more. We're going to go into those straight-legged Pilates in four, three, two, one. Here we go. Double pulse, double pulse. Good. If your knees are bent, that's fine. What's after this? Who remembers? We only have two more. It's our elbow plank and then our tall plank. See if you can keep going here. If you need to put your head down, that's fine. You're still working the lower abs. Here we go. Four. Let's transition pretty quickly. And elbows. Woo! Here we go. Squeeze those glutes. Feet together if you can. You can put your palms up if you want. We're here for 30 seconds. You can do that saw if you would like. Good. Is everyone smiling with me? All right, we're going to the tall plank in four, three, two, one. Tall plank and hold. Here we go. Too slow, four, fast. And make it fast. Fast. Two. Really pull that knee to the chest and in and in. We're going to do two more sets of this. Here we go. Pull it in. 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 Four. Three. Two, last one, last one, yay, here we go, four, three, two, one, lower it down, Woo. hands under the shoulders, stretch that back, we stretch those abs, sit back, child's pose, we're going to go into the other glute, you and I need to get a drink, I need a drink real quick. We'll do the other side. See, it's gone like that, hasn't it? Quick, quick and fast. All right, let's do the other side. Let's see if I can get this in the right order this time. Okay, I'm going to face you this time. And we're going to lift that leg up. Now remember, you're trying to get the knee over the hips. And we're going to go down, up, down. We're here for 30. And you're doing great. Down, up, down. Now make sure you're doing the other side. Okay? Make sure that you're not repeating it on that same leg. That would be disastrous, I would think. Four, we're going to hold it up and pulse it in that bent position. Three, two, one. Here we go, pulse it up. Up, up. Hello. Now, I feel like my side, this side is fatiguing faster than my other side. It's just how it is. We're not even on both sides, and that's okay. We've got 10 more seconds here. We're going to go into that crossover with the bent leg. Okay? In four, three, two, and one. Let's, we're going to cross it over, lift, drop, lift. And again, this is your own tempo. We're here for 30 seconds. And then we're going to extend that leg straight. <clears throat> and we'll go in and out. We're extend and bend. That's our next one. Now, check, do an ab check for me. Do that ab check. Make sure it's on good. Good. Now we're going to go extend and lift. Now try to keep that knee above the hip if you possibly can. Woo! Yeah, this left side. Or mine's left. I don't know what side you guys are on right now. But we've got 15 more seconds here. And then we're going to straighten the leg and just pulse it up. And then we'll go into the rainbow. And we'll be done with this part of it. Okay? In four, three, two. Extend the leg out and lift it up. Okay. Okay, it's getting serious now. It sure is. And squeeze that glute. Our last one up here is that rainbow where we keep the leg as straight as we can and we're gonna cross it over and then move it out to the side, okay? We're gonna go into that in four and three and two 
And one, here we go. Over. 30 seconds. You got it. You got it. You got it. Think about that core. What's it doing right now? We've got 15 seconds. You can do anything for 15 seconds. Anything, anything. And then we're going to lay down and finish this out. Oh, I just kicked my ear. <laughs> In. Four. Three. Two. One. Yes! Lay down quickly. Get on that side. This bottom leg is 45 degrees. Bottom leg out. Lift it up. Toes facing the floor. We're almost done. We've almost got it. Up. Down. Up. Down. Very good. Now we're going to hold it up and pulse it up. Pulse. 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 Very good. Now the next thing we're doing is that knee and toe touch. Knee, toe touch. Okay? We've got a little bit longer here. Do an ab check for me. Do a smile check for me. I know you all still love me. And we're going to do that knee and toe. Six, seven, here we go. And knees, toes, knees, toes, knees, toes. Very good. Oh, yes, here we go. Keep going, keep going, keep going. We're going to do the in and push it out as next. Right? In and push it out. Then we carry it to the front and do our last part. Yes. Uh-huh. Four. Three. Two. In and push it out. Here we go. And in. Push. In. Push. Good. Let's do about four more. Since we're a little bit running out of time. I don't know. Maybe I talked too long at the beginning. But I do want to get you out of here so you can do what you need to do for the rest of the day. And hopefully... We can all walk and talk and do these things we still need to do today. <laughs> Let's hold the leg out straight. Hold. We're going to carry it to the front. Front. And back. Three more. Front. And back. Two more. Front. And back. One more. Front. We're going to hold it up here. We're going to do eight lifts. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, one. Yes. Oh, roll over. Let's take that leg. Cross it over. Get a good stretch. Woo. Yeah. See, now your other side probably feels fine now, right? See? No big deal. No big deal. Oh, get a good stretch there. We're going to do our last thing. It's a one-minute finale. And I always tell my class, I want you to think that when you're done, balloons, confetti, Everyone stands up to applause. It's the last thing we're going to do. So we're going to go into a hollow hold. So you can be here. You can be here. You can be down. I'm going to be right here. And then you do four bicycles. Three, four. Hold. Two, three, four. Bicycle. Two, three, four. If that's not for you, you can do regular bicycles the whole time. But we got one minute on. Then we'll do a little stretch and you'll be out of here. Are we ready? Four, three, two, let's hold it. Hold. And now let's do our four bicycles. Four, three, two, one. Hold one, two, three, four bicycles. Four, three, two, let's do it again. One, two, three, four. Now the lower those legs are, the harder it is. You might want to be up here. Three, four, and one, two, three. I do want you to keep that lower back on the floor the whole time. Here we go. One, two, three. We have 25 more seconds. You got it. Two, three, four. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. Keep pushing. Oh, you're almost there. 10 more seconds. Let's see if we can do one more set. One more set. One, two, Three, four, and one, two, three, four. Stretch it out. Reach it long, long. Good morning, stretch. I'm going to turn down this music. Actually, I'm going to turn it off, I think. Keep stretching. 
Keep stretching long. Woo! Pull your knees into your chest. Rock back and forth. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Let's do those glute stretches one more time here. Figure four on each side. If you need to leave right now, that's fine. But make sure you stretch. Okay, let's switch legs. All right, let's roll over onto our tummies. Hands under the shoulders. Push up back. And then push back to your child's pose. Come up to your downward facing dog. Walk your dog out. And then walk your hands back to your feet, bend into your knees. And then just roll up slowly through the spine. When you get to the top, I'm going to see a big shoulder roll. Good, 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 good. Stick one leg out in front of you, flex the foot, hinge from the hips, keep your belly button strong, feel your hamstring stretching, and then I want you to go a little deeper in that stretch by putting the toe down, and then roll up through the spine, let's do the other side. Flex the foot, hinge from the hips, Drop your toe. And roll up. Good. Let's inhale. Let's see. I'm three minutes over. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, arms down. Inhale, arms up. Last one. I want you to take those hands, put them on your back, and tell yourself good job because that was a hard workout and you made time to do it. Your body thanks you. Your mind thanks you. Your soul thanks you. And I thank you for being here. Please, if you feel like it was a good workout, share it with your friends. It's, it's a good thing to be moving in, in this time so that we're not all stuck, stuck inside and not moving. So feel free to share it. Um, thank you again for coming. Maybe I'll do another one next week sometime. Um, and if there's anything else you'd like to see on Facebook Live, any other movement classes, let me know. All right. Thank you for being here.